going to show you how you can screen mirror as well as use Samsung DeX from the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 or Note 20 Ultra directly to your LG Smart TV using a cable here. This is a HDMI to USB Type-C. Really quickly, this is the cable here looks like. This is inexpensive. This one here is actually a 4K at 60 FPS. I'll put a link below where I got this. But you have a HDMI to USB Type-C. HDMI, we're going to plug that into the HDMI port on the TV. And the USB Type-C, we're going to plug that directly into our uh, Samsung Galaxy. So let me go ahead and plug the HDMI part into the back of the TV first. Another thing I want to note too is with this cable connection, it's a direct connection. The connection has nothing to do with your home Wi-Fi network or anything. So it's a super fast, it's probably the fastest connection that you're going to have. So the HDMI is plugged in to the back of the TV. Now let's plug in my... You also have to make sure that it's on a correct HDMI port, okay? Now right away, mine brings up Samsung DeX. Yours might bring up the screen mirroring. Samsung DeX is just a desktop. It basically makes your S20 into like a desktop on a like a desktop computer on like a monitor. Now just really quickly, how do you switch between um, Samsung DeX and screen mirroring? Well, right now we're on screen mirroring, okay? So if I want to switch to some, to uh, the, the screen mirroring, we have to do is scroll down to your notifications here, okay? And then again, right now we're on Samsung DeX. So you see the horizontal line right here? What I want you to do is scroll down again, and now just look for DeX, okay? If it's not on this first page here, swipe to the left, and you'll probably see it, okay? You can see my DeX is on. So if I go ahead and turn off DeX, now it should automatically go into screen mirror. So give it one second, and now you can see that we are screen mirror. Everything that you do on the phone, it's gonna be an actual and exact replica of what's happening on your TV. So you use screen mirror. Maybe you want to show some photos and videos on a big screen or you have work documents, whatnot. Only thing you need is a ca this cable right here to go ahead and relay that onto the, uh, the TV here. And you can see how responsive this is, okay? So right now we're in screen mirroring. Let's bring it back to DeX. So simply what you do is go ahead and scroll down like this. And then with the little, um, the horizontal line again, scroll down and then look for DeX, okay? My DeX is over here. Here it is, so let me tap on DeX right here and to give that one second. And now we're using the Samsung DeX. So now we're on Samsung DeX, so how do you use this? Okay, so basically you can turn your um, 20 here into like a mouse pad or a track pad. Just go ahead and scroll down again like this, the notifications. And then you want to go ahead and scroll down. You want to scroll down again, or just scroll down here, and then you should see right here it says Samsung DeX. And it says, use your phone as a touchpad. So if I tap on that, now this turns into a mouse pad. Now if you look on here, you should see my mouse. You see it moving around, so I can do, I mean, pretty much whatever I want to do here, okay? So let me give you another quick example too. Let's go ahead and open up Gallery. And let me go ahead and show you a quick photo here. And I'm gonna play a video too. So here's a photo here. And then of course, if you pinch your trackpad, you can zoom in and out here as well. Now, let me show you a, um, a video here. So let me go back here. So here's a video here. Let me just go ahead and play this video. Let's see what the audio comes out of, okay? Okay, let me play that again. Not sure if you heard. It's only a, it's a fast video, but let's... Testing. One, two, three. Testing. One, two. Okay, let me put on pause. Now, the audio is coming out from my Note 20 here. You can also make it the audio come out of the TV. How you do that is very simple. Just go ahead and just scroll down to notifications again. And then you have right here where it says audio output. Okay, so tap on that. And then right now by default, or it's on my phone right now, so the audio's coming out of my phone. If I wanted to come out of my TV, I gotta select up here, it says display device. Okay, it says display device, so let me tap on that. Now, let me replay that video again. Let me just go back to my, my touchpad here. And then let's, let's go ahead and uh, let me rewind this back and let's play now. One, two, three. Testing, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now the audio is actually coming out of the TV. So pretty simple. And if you wanted to disconnect, you can just pull the plug, okay? Pretty simple.